Hey everybody, it's Heather Nichols and you are in my office. This is my office that's been my office for a long time. Um, and it is, has just gotten like a, like a revamp, like a reboot, like a redo, um, because my whole business has gotten a redo. Um, so one of the things that has been going on for me is there's been a lot of, um, I've had a lot of body things happening right now. And to me, my body and my business are so connected and, um, my business to me is my life. It's the business of everything that I do and everything that I create, which includes my body. Um, you know, if we want to have, um, a good relationship or a great relationship with our bodies or even a phenomenal one, which is what I would like to have, um, communion with my body, like a different, a totally different reality with it. Um, we've, we've got to include it. We've got to include our bodies in creation. Our bodies have an amazing way of contributing to everything that we create. And <clears throat> I have, I've been talking about this a little bit here and there, but, um, but I, I've been, um, I, I talked about this more on the last video that I posted, but, um, I've had this, you know, I came home from a summer of travel and all kinds of things. And, um, and really was, uh, my body was like, really, you know, I, ha I was actually having a lot of pain, a lot of pain in different areas. And, um, and so my body has taken me on this journey of like really showing me, Hey, you've got to be a lot more relaxed. Um, it's time to create from a totally different space. It's time to have a level of ease that you've never had before. And, and the cool thing is, is my body, what my body is asking for, I know it's always something that my business also, like it's, I, I know that if I choose to honor my body, it's going to be something that's going to really contribute to my business growing because that's how consciousness works. Um, that's one of the joy of business tools, um, is including your body in the creation of your business. And, and this is a massive conversation that, um, I've learned so much from over the years through all the different things that I've done, including the joy of business and facilitating those classes and, um, and, and all the things that I've done with my body. And, and so when my body is giving me these signals, like I was, I was having, um, I, I'm editing my, I'm writing a book on bodies and, um, been editing it. And I actually haven't been, I, I was like, I carved out like three days in my schedule last weekend. I wasn't able to get to it. And then, but it wasn't because I was procrastinating. It was actually because my body was in so much pain that it did not want to be on the computer. And I was, I was having all this like chest pain, like, you know, like I'm not talking about like heart attack stuff, but like just tension in here, you know, where it's like from this, you know, this and this. And, um, and so my body was just like, no, like, I'm not going to be sitting at the computer. That's not what I'm going to do. And I'm going to rebel and I'm going to say, you know, buzz off and <laughs> no, that's not happening. Um, and so so I had to, so, but whenever that shows up for me, I always go, okay, what's right about this that I'm not getting, which is an access consciousness tool. That's a brilliant question to ask anytime you have something wonky going on. What's right about this I'm not getting. So I was asking that and, um, and, you know, really realizing like, okay, well, obviously I'm not going to be able to deal with, I'm not going to be able to, you know, do the editing of the book. So I'm going to need to deal with my body. I'm going to need to handle what's going on, which took me down this beautiful path of like finding all of these incredible resources for different, di all kinds of different things that are even in a week have turned around my reality with my body so dynamically and are contributing so much to, you know, what's, what's going on. And like to, to, I'm, my body is feeling so much better, like 95% of the pain is gone and I'm, I'm feeling a lot stronger and there's so many cool things going on. And in the meantime, I've also been really creating some beautiful things with my business. 
Um, there's a podcast about to be launched. There's all kinds of really exciting things happening. Restructuring of my whole staff. I mean, just really cool stuff. So it was really time for like a life business reality upgrade. And so one of the things I did in my office was I actually created my space to match what it is, like how I'm creating, what my body is asking for and what my business is asking for. And um, I'm not a desk person. I don't like sitting. I don't really like sitting in chairs. That's not so much my favorite thing to do. And I do want to be able to sit and type and edit and, you know, do kind of deep work. And to use Cal Newport's term, I love that book, Deep Work, if you haven't read it. Um, I'm listening to it for the second time now. Um, brilliant work, brilliant book. Um, and to to do deep work, like concentrating and focused work, um, I need to have a way to do that in a way that works for my body. And so how am I gonna how am I gonna create that? So I've restructured my space and I've also restructured my time. Um, and I'll go more into all of that in future videos, but um, let's talk about the space right now. Maybe next time I'll talk about the time. Um, so restructuring my space. So one of the things that I do, I mean, this is my, I have my, um, I have my yoga, my like yoga area, and I have all these props here that are, um, you know, I've got my, um, like my balls and my rollers and all these, all these things. Um, I, I recently, um, bought a softball, um, to be like doing some rolling yumminess on my body. So that's been amazing. Um, but just setting up a space where it's really easy for me at any moment to just get down on the floor, do what I need to do, or do some yoga or do some weights or whatever. Um, take care of my body. And I do started doing that incrementally throughout the day a little bit more. Um, especially, you know, having learned some, some new tools that I'm using, it's been really cool. Um, and now here's this really cool thing that I want to show you here. So this is my, this is my workstation and, um, it's, it's a tripod desk. Um, that is really amazing. It's adjustable on all levels, the height of the whole thing, you know, cause it's a tripod. I've got my ball there that I sit on. So, um, the whole thing is adjustable and, um, and it, um, I can adjust the height of the, of the keyboard and I've got the laptop up here so I can look straight ahead. Um, cause that's something you want to be able to do is have your, what you're looking at be here, but have your, you know, where you're typing is down here. So, um, having that has been really amazing and I can take it with me. I can move around with it. I can go outside. I can sit, I can stand right now. It's on the standing position. So I've been doing a lot of standing work, which has been really awesome. Um, I've got all my like books and resources there, which is another little portable desk. So I've got lots of these and I have this one that I can use as like a little lap desk. So just some really cool, cool, you know, like body tools, you know, and then I've got all these, like these, you know, post-its on my walls for, um, for, you know, ideas. And so I don't have to be on the computer all the time. I can, cause I don't really, it's not my goal to be on the computer a ton of the time. It's my goal to create a different world, <laughs> um, to empower people to know that they can create anything they would like to create and include their bodies in the process. Um, and so, so I, I, you know, I love, I pulled out my colored pens. I've got that over here. Um, you know, this like bucket of pens and, and just all these things that, um, I'm using to, um, you know, I can just, if I get an idea, I can just put it on one of my boards at one time at any time and just go, Oh, I have an idea for a podcast or, you know, whatever. Um, and so it's very alive. It's a living organism. It's like, it makes my business feel like a living organism and it really includes my body. And if I'm sitting here and I'm working and I'm, you know, things are getting tight or I'm getting tired, I've got these things right here behind me. I can just plunk down and you know, mix it up, do some stretches, do some strengthening things and, um, and, you know, go about my day. Um, if we spend, I mean, I can't even imagine spending eight hours a day, just like not paying attention to my body sitting at a desk. I would never be able to do that. I don't know how anybody can. I think if you can, 
your body might be asking for something really different. You may want to look at that, or you just might be like really, you know, like superhuman. <laughs> um, but that's not something I've ever been able to do. And so, but I really would like to create a lot. So I've got to, I've, you know, finding my way, um, to something that's really working for me. And, um, it's been really, really beautiful, really nourishing and very stimulating creative, creatively. Like it's stimulated my creativity quite a bit. Um, it's a very fun time around here. Let's just say that I'm having the joy of business. What can I say? <laughs> and just asking for more of it all the time. So I hope that contributes to you in some way. And um, if it did, please, you know, do the thing like subscribe, follow all those things, share, you know, to get this out into the algorithm more so that more people can see it and hopefully benefit from, um, what I'm sharing here and, um, yeah, have a lot of fun creating and have fun with your body. Have fun with your amazing, sweet, incredible body.